I'm here to tell y'all, having kids ain't for the week. Do you hear me? I do feel like every night, running around in the clubs. Yeah, I thought I had everything. I thought I never needed love. That's when God sent an angel. Street. Yeah, we back again with another spring clean with me. This time we in my living room. When I say my children don't give a damn, they don't. They do not give a damn. how they do my living room. And the crazy part is, I don't have no little bitty kids. I got teenagers. So, welcome. If you're new here, my name is Shalitha. And if you're a returning neighbor, welcome back. Yeah, so we about to tackle this living room. But first, let me show y'all what it's looking like. And then we about to get into it. I'm paying this camera. So, yeah. About to tackle this living room and I'm about to let y'all watch me do this real quick and then I'll be back. So let's get into it. Having kids is ghetto. Cause this is why. This is what they do to your living room. Them dog on teenagers, boy I tell you.
Dirty soda and stuff for me. Spend a day to get my mind blown. Dress it up and go to NASA. Two hundred miles on the dash. Got a roll of pound up a gas. Put your lanes in the Grand Rapids. We the one kept it cool with all these niggas till these niggas start acting. Shoot a nigga like a film in a movie, nigga go to the map. We ballin' like the Marsh Madness. All these cops shoot a nigga tragic. I don't want to live in lavish. Like I'm playing for the Mavericks. I don't want for the bitch to buy the map before we even know she average. Dirty money in the cook. The 45 by my good. My young nigga in the cook. Take you out for some joints. Count the spot, no rush. I'm on the one way flush. Loud packs, smell it much. This fucking police can't touch me. This fucking police can't touch me. This fucking nigga can't touch me. Dirty soda in the stuff. Spend a day to get my mind blown. Dress it up and go to NASA. 200 miles on the dash. Got a roll of pound up a gas. Put your lanes in the Grand Rapids. We the one who kept it cool with all these niggas till these niggas start acting. Shoot a nigga like a film in a movie, nigga. Go on the map. We ballin' like the Marsh Madness. All these cops shoot a nigga tragic. I don't want to live in lavish. Like I'm playing for the Mavericks. I don't want for the bitch to buy the map before we even know she average. Dirty money in the cook, the 45 by my good. My young nigga in the cook, take you out for some joints. Count the spot, no rush. I'm on the one way flush. Loud packs, smell it much. These fucking police can't touch me. These fucking police can't touch me. These fucking niggas can't touch me. to tell y'all having kids ain't for the week do you hear me it ain't for the week at heart jesus
Facebook. It was this point of the video that I noticed that I had lost all the audio. So now I'm just telling y'all that we're finished cleaning the living room and I'm painting the camera around so that y'all can see what the finished product looked like. So that's what I'm doing right here. We are just giving y'all an overview of my clean living room after I have spring and deep cleaned this living room thanks to my children always leaving it a mess. So yeah, that's what we're doing right here, y'all. Just showing y'all the living room. And hopefully y'all stay tuned to the end of this video because the rest of the video is a um voiceover because the rest of the audio is gone for some reason. So right here I'm just telling y'all that I'm about to go do um a protein treatment in my hair and I'm gonna come back and show y'all what it's looking like once I'm done so yeah so I have put the protein treatment in my hair y'all and I'm just showing y'all what it looked like if y'all are from back in the day and remember when people used to do freezes or whatever in their hair I think that's what they were called well that's what we used to call them freezes um this is what the alpha g protein treatment does to your hair if you're familiar with the alpha g protein you know it makes your hair really really hard and you have to sit under the dryer you know once you put it in it's really really sticky and messy so that's what i have done to my hair because of course i know i'm on a healthy hair journey trying to get my hair to grow back and all of that so this is what i'm talking about right here in this clip and just showing y'all what my hair look like and how hard it is and all that other good stuff so i'll be back okay so right here i came back really really quick because i want to show y'all this new ice cream by bluebell called the gooey butter cake y'all that ice cream is so good only if you are familiar with the ooey gooey butter cake that they sell up in walmart now don't get me wrong it's really really sweet to me but i love the way the ice cream tastes it is really really good y'all should try especially like i said if y'all familiar with the ooey gooey cake you can buy it from Walmart, and I also heard that they sell it at certain gas stations. I'm not sure. I want to say my coworker told me that it's sold inside of, like, the, um, what are they called? It used to be, um, what are those? They 7-Elevens now, but they used to be Stripes. So, I think you can buy them in there, but I always find them inside of Walmart because they have the bigger ones in Walmart, and... I love the cake, so I knew I was going to love the ice cream. Plus, I seen someone um, make a homemade ooey gooey cake and put the ice cream on top and then drizzled some caramel on top. Just giving big back energy. Do y'all hear me? Big back energy. So that's what I'm talking about right here, y'all. Just showing y'all the ice cream that I picked up from H-E-B, and it's really, really good. I've been eating on it since I bought it, y'all. So, yeah go out and try it if y'all haven't tried it i will not steer y'all wrong i promise you try it so that's what i'm seeing right here in this clip so yeah be back y'all once i'm finished with my hair so here i'm just telling y'all that i just washed my hair out and that i am going to roller set it and i was just telling y'all if uh, my roller set come out looking like madam cj J. walker y'all just mind y'all business because uh that's probably what it's gonna be looking like once i am done so yeah <laughs> girl yeah <laughs> i gotta laugh doing this voice voiceover because baby i am so freaking goofy when i came around that cam camera and was looking at these curls y'all i could do was laugh so that's why i'm laughing so hard but here i am telling y'all that my hair looks like big worm when he had those rollers in his head on Friday after next, y'all. I couldn't do nothing but laugh at my dog on stuff when I was recording this. And I hate that the audio cut out. Oh, my God. Because it was just too funny. But anyway, y'all. I'm just telling y'all that I am going to, like, separate the curls and all that and slick the edges down. And I, what I, that's what I was going to do with this hairstyle just to see, you know, what it was going to give or whatever. So, I'm just, like, patting it and just, girl, laughing at myself because these rollers look... The roller set just looks so funny. It reminds me of back in the day when I used to roller set my hair. But when I had a whole lot more hair than what I have now. But yeah, y'all, that's what I was telling y'all. And I also was saying that I probably wasn't going to pick y'all back up until the next day, which was live. So y'all will see in the next clip. So here I am again, y'all, laughing my butt off because my hair reminds me of the lady that played Madam C.J. Walker on the movie, y'all. That's why I put the picture up on the screen. But in all actuality, it didn't look too bad. And I also remind myself of 
Eddie Murphy when he played the pastor in Vampire in Brooklyn, if y'all ever seen that. So that's why I put that picture of the pastor on the screen as well. Y'all, I am so goofy. I sent this to my kids in our little group chat, and baby, my daughter said, you look like a 60-year-old. I was like, well, when I tell y'all my kids don't give a damn what they take to me, they do not. But anyway, y'all, I was pulling the curls in. I, see, I went put on some makeup, child. I thought I was looking cute. But it didn't really, it didn't really look too bad. I really liked it, but I just feel, hate that my hair is so short. And I also said in this part, if y'all made it to the part, this part of the video, to leave the big eye emojis in the comments, y'all. And this is about to conclude the end of the video, y'all. I hope y'all stay to the end. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm laughing my butt off, y'all, because I am too silly for my own good. But anyway, make sure, <laughs> be sure to, uh, like, comment, and subscribe, like I said. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Because I'm about to end this video right here, y'all. See y'all.